Hey folks, Mobile Geezer out here with another camera comparison, this time between the iPhone XR and the Moto G7 Plus. Uh, when I put the comparison between the Moto G7 Plus and the Galaxy S10e up last week, a lot of people were surprised and really enjoyed the uh, footage from the Moto G7 Plus and asked for a little more. So I thought I'd give you this one today. This is the front facing camera shooting at 1080p, 30 frames per second. So I'll turn these around, keep shooting at 1080p, 30 frames per second on the rear cameras. So here we are with the rear cameras, 1080p, 30 frames per second on both. See, it's a beautiful hot day out here by the bay. Got a number of boats out here on the water. A lot of people trying to enjoy this weather. Let's zoom in a little bit. Just two times zoom on the iPhone 10R. Eight times zoom on the Moto G7 Plus. Let's go back a little bit. Two times. It seems to be about two times on the Moto G7 Plus. Back all the way. Pan around a little bit. Got a lot of kids out here. rain this afternoon so I figured I better get out and get this done. You see a little shake every once in a while when my monopod is sitting on rocks. So that's 1080p at 30 frames per second. And I'll uh, put it up to 60 frames per second and let you see what that looks like. So now we're shooting at 1080p 60 frames per second on both devices. Looks pretty good from here. Try zooming in again. traffic over there going on the bridge. There's full zoom on the Moto G7 Plus. Plus the iPhone's already at full zoom. It's pretty distorted at full zoom on the G7 to me. Zoom back out. Now let's take him for a little walk. Guys, let me know how everything looks and sounds. The stability looks. I'm walking on very shaky ground here. And after this, I'll go over to the other side of town. We'll shoot in the park over by the ducks and we'll shoot some 4k over there I'll take a few pictures here before i get out of here and that'll be it for this side of town okay back at 1080p 30 frames per second so let's see do a little focus test here
Looks to me like the iPhone is winning this test. Can't tell for sure till I get it home on the computer. Okay, now we'll take it across town and we'll do some 4K stuff. So here we are on the other side of town over at the park. Right now shooting on our shooting our usual brook and I'm shooting at the 4K 30 frames per second on both devices. Of course the iPhone 10 R was shooting 4K at 24, 30 and 60 frames per second. But the Mobile G7 Plus only shoots 4K at 30 frames per second, so we'll just keep it there. Now, now we'll go walk a little bit. Check the stability in 4K. And we'll try running a little bit. You guys let me know how bad it looks or how good it looks. Creek. Of course, you're going to hear traffic from the street overhead. There's the creek. So I'm using a pan around here. Let's see. The creek is not running very high because it's been kind of dry here lately, even though we've had a little bit of rain. dark. You see the fountain's not doing much today, but at least it's on. Let's see if we can find the ducks over here. See the ducks yet. So zooming in on the fountain. This full zoom on the 10R. Two times, four times, six times, and eight times on a Moto G7 Plus. Zoom back out. And I'll walk around the pond a little bit, see if we can find the ducks. And then I'll shoot a few photos and we'll be done for the day. Alright, I'll shoot a few photos, folks, and that'll be it for today.
Well, that's it for today, folks. Shot a little video, 1080p, 30 and 60 frames per second, 4K at uh, 30 frames per second, and gave you a little front-facing video, and now we're back at 1080p, 30 frames per second. So, as always, you guys let me know how everything looked and sounded, and uh, as always, comments are welcome, and thanks for watching. Oh,